Hi everyone. So um, today I want to talk about Ula. So in my link tree um, on, um, I say um a lot, so just deal with it. Or take, take a drink. Uh, take a drink of apple cider vinegar. Okay. Anyway, on my link tree on my main page, uh, I have all the books from Ula to Amazon. It's one of the things that I cannot recommend enough. So I met the guys that wrote the book uh, more than once, and at the end of this, I'm going to put my pictures with them, like a celebrity. Um, and they are amazing. They lit a fire in me that I forgot I even had. They put things in perspective for me. They are more than motivational. I feel like they actually give a shit about me. It's not like... Um, Whatever. It, they're just amazing. And on the link, there are all of them. If nothing else, you get the seven, the Ula. Oh my God, the name of it just went out of my head, but just get it. So I have these and maybe if I get 30 subscribers, I'm not expecting it. So I say that as a joke to myself because this is more of uh, recordings to make myself accountable. And if there were more of you out there helping me make myself accountable and back and forth, that would be wonderful. Um, but if not, I'm doing this for me. So, but I do have these. Is that one of their seminars and it's free, it's for me. So I have those and I have these. So Ula is, um, basic. I am right. I am. The mantra is so powerful because if in your head you're saying, Oh my God, I suck. Oh my God, I messed up today on my Weight Watchers. Oh, sorry, WW. Um, I, I, why even bother? I ate past my points. I might as well eat more. So I, I messed up. I can't do this. I'm too stupid. I'm too stupid. I'm too fat. I'm too whatever. Then that's your reality. It's all about manifestation. And Julian and I have our list of things that we want to manifest and nothing is out of, nothing is out of reach. I mean, if you're watching this, you're not like, um, pinky in the brain or Vegeta that you want immortality or to rule the world. You're doing this because you want to be a better version of yourself. So do an I am statements. It's just a positive reinforcement for yourself. And when I'm feeling really down, I pick up my book and I go back over them because sometimes I need a reminder that I am worthy of feeling good. I am worthy of what I want. I am worthy of financial stability. So, so the first thing on this is my I am statements. And I'm going to read you a couple from every page. So again, on my link tree, Right there on top, I made it like the first thing of Ula books. I can't believe I actually made a link tree. Oh, I'm so fucking fancy. Anyway, so I have, I am infinite. I can do anything. I am strong. I am love. I am kind. I am smart. And I am beautiful. Um, I am truth. I am amazing. I am bliss. I am balanced. I have clarity. I am wealthy and mindful, and I am human. I am a miracle. Because do you know what it takes to actually have a baby, to get pregnant? It took us 10 years. Um, and there are people with like seven kids or whatever, and I guess for them maybe it wasn't as hard. But the likelihood of having a human is a miracle. So always remember, you are a miracle. You exist. And you're a miracle. Um, I am full of gratitude. Okay, so those, those are the things that I am. And I always leave extra pages because I might find more things that I am. I don't know. Okay, so finance is my first one. And these aren't in any particular order. But I will say finance is a major goal of mine. And I feel like it's something I've always struggled with because my relationship with money wasn't healthy. Um, growing up, we did not have money or whatever. We had a roof over our head. We had food on the table, but I didn't have the things that other kids had. And I don't know, whatever. So sometimes when I get money, instead of stocking it away, I stock up on things. So downstairs we have 15 bottles of detergent. 
because if I run out of money, we need clean clothes. I have food in the pantry that, and then I spend money on eating out, whatever, which annoys the crap out of me. But I'm, I'm learning to have a better relationship with money. So I am worthy of all the riches I desire. I, real, I rely on no one to pay for us. My bank accounts are replenished daily. I, I taught Julian financial responsibility. That's a big deal for me. And that's why we have our, it's also on my link tree, um, daily cash flow book. So he does get an allowance. He has chores that he has to do just because he exists in this house. And this is part of his household. And he should have pride in that. Um, and he should contribute. But he also has extra things that he does. So he has his own money. Um, and I want him to understand checks and balances. I want him to understand that money does not just grow on trees. Take it down, Ollie. Um, so I want him to understand his financial responsibility. I have a money magnet. I love that one. Um, money flows to me freely. I am worthy of positive cash flow. I am worthy of positive cash flow. Because I am a worthy person. I am worthy of my desires. So, Ula Field, I'm actually going back to school. Um, with everything going on in my life, I never finished my degree, but I will soon. So, I have the power to create the success and build the wealth I desire and deserve. I am a LCSW. I am a a gold, uh, um, I hope help others as a life coach. I am smart success. I am a smart, successful business woman. People come to me for guidance. I attract like-minded people who value what I can offer and appreciate it. Remember you have value. Your time is valuable. Just like at a doctor's office, if you're late, they charge you. Your time when you sit there for an hour is valuable. That's your time. Of course, I still wait. I love my doctor, whatever, but I'm just saying. I follow through for myself and others. I'm able to give back. Okay. Uh, I don't know about the last one. I, I, it says I get money from doing card readings because I do angel cards, but I don't, I don't know about that. So my next one is Ula Fun. Um, I go on three vacations, seven plus days a year without any financial constrictions. I do go, we do go on once a year. And like I said, I save change and cut coupons and whatever, but I don't want to do that. I enjoy saving the change. And it's almost like a game, like that again. It's, it's almost like a challenge for me. And I enjoy that, but I would like to be able to just say, okay, here I go. Um, I have visited all the states I desire and I enjoy my time in each. I am a free spirit who appreciates the abundance of love, laughter in my life. I love trying new adventures. I live in the moment. Tired of the anxiety sometimes, you know, I want to go do this or that. And it's like, I can't, I can't leave the house. I can't leave the house yet. And I would like to just live in the moment. Um, I have visited over 200 beaches worldwide. I cross off and add to my book it list yearly. Ulapalooza Vegas. I don't even know if they still do up to it, but if they do, I want it. Ali wants to say hi. Here's Ali. You say hi, Ali. You say hi. So next one is Ula Fitness. I'm working very hard on this. My foot has healed. I do yoga daily. I'm aware of what and why I eat. I go to boot camp once a week. So I don't go to boot camp, but I do go to bar. Woohoo! Out oh, here's Starlight now. I'm consistent in my eating and workouts. I'm at my goal weight. I have no and I give no excuses. I show up for myself. I am balanced and healthy. I love myself and how I feel when I work out. Oh, okay, my starlight wants to come up. So, Ula, family goal. Okay, okay, girl. 
Hank's the only one, and thank God, because he's like 700 pounds. He's Starlight. Okay, you girls got, you got to go, you got to go. Okay, so the next one is Ula family. So, um, my family loves and respects each other, which right now is not necessarily true. But my family loves and respects each other. We lift each other up. I am remarried or committed to someone. He is kind, respectful, communicates. He is professional. He loves me for me as I am. He loves Julian. He wants to take care of us, but he doesn't need to because I'm financially secure. Girl, stop it. Please, stop. He's funny. He can do for himself. He is faithful. He is honest. And he is transparent. Okay, so that's Ula family. I mean, I have a lot. We listen before reacting. I'm helping Julian have a successful future. I'm providing Julian with an amazing life full of beautiful memories. Next one is friends. Really went to town on that uh, commitment, mate. Friends. Uh, I attract like-minded people. We lift each other up with positive energy. My friends are honest. So I, I notice in all of my things with family, um, finding a mate, my friends, honesty and um, lifting each other up is very important because it's all of it. My friends are kind. Toxic people take themselves out of my life for me. I develop less than friendships with ease. We laugh often. We, time, we find time for each other. Next one is faith. So with faith, I had a little bit of an issue at first. So I was raised Catholic, but there are a lot of things in the Catholic religion. My mom is no longer a Catholic fanatic as we were um, growing up. There are a lot of things that I don't agree with the Catholic religion, and I'm not going to get into that, but I like the foundation of faith. And um, I'm more of a spirituality person. I believe in, you know, kindness and things like that. So I have trouble with this at first and then I really sat and thought about it and I even I asked one or two people um, at the seminar I asked them like like where do I go with this so faith I do Reiki on myself down I learn more about religion and spirit and spiritual faith daily because I want to know more I know that there are multiple religions and I don't know about them all and I want to um, I need and want I need and want with excess to share. My faith keeps me grounded. I choose a peaceful, calm spirit. I let go and I trust. The divine spirit helps guide me. My mind and body are in complete alignment with the universe and I am always in the flow. I like that one. I let go of fear and pain. I live in love and I give it up to the universe and God. So these are my seven F's. I feel like I skipped one. Fun, fitness, family, friends. Hey, no, I didn't. Um, so if you want information on Ula, you can go to my tree link and it is there. I have some where I wrote down my, my most important ones. Um, Reiki master teacher, successful business person. That's important to me. I am going to end this here because it's getting too long. And um, like, share, subscribe. Anyway, if you go on the link tree, you get the Ula. There's the seven basics of Ula. There's Ula Woman, which a friend of mine, her story's in there. And she's freaking amazing. And um, it's worth the read. And um, what I do is I, okay, stop it. I, stop Stop. I um, have it on CD so I can listen to it in the car. And if I'm having a down day, they just, they lift me up. So I strongly suggest it. Okay, bye. Oh, I can't hit the stop button.